Hello everyone, on the occasion of the 2024 Suzuka 8 Hours, Kawasaki is presenting a hydrogen-powered motorbike based on the Ninja H2SX. This is the first time a manufacturer has presented a motorbike that can use hydrogen as fuel, because it uses an internal combustion engine. Remember that hydrogen is the most abundant element in the universe. At least in theory, it could be an ecological fuel because in fuel cells, hydrogen, when combined with oxygen to produce electricity, produces only electricity, water, and heat. On the other hand, our sun and other stars produce their energy through nuclear fusion, which forms helium through hydrogen atoms. The brand executive assured that Kawasaki is working on hybrid and electric motorcycles. We were looking for a machine that achieved carbon neutrality, but was still fun with great acceleration. We will continue development so we can offer it to users by 2030, the project not only uses the Kawasaki H2SX chassis, but also its supercharged engine, which Kawasaki says has been adapted to allow direct hydrogen injection. That would explain how a working prototype has been developed so quickly in automotive terms. The engine is a 998 CCC supercharged four-cylinder from a Kawasaki H2SX with hydrogen-capable injectors. The appearance of the motorbike is very original and even a bit big. If you look at it, it is clear that it is something special and almost extraterrestrial. At the rear, there are two large trunks protruding, which are actually 25 liter hydrogen tanks. The tank is the same as that used by the Toyota Mirai, which is powered by a hydrogen fuel cell. Kawasaki has not revealed the engine power or weight of the bike, but it is estimated that the prototype currently has a range of more than 100 km. The pilot who completed the lap of the Suzuka circuit stated that it behaves normally like a petrol motorbike. So that's our review for today. See you in the next video.